What's up, people? We back with part two of why I quit rapping. And uh, I'm going to make this one about just the same length. But here we go. Um, It's because I realize that the game is changing, man. Like, I've been rapping since early 2000s, I guess you could say. Something like that. And uh, I never had the highest production quality. So, I guess you could say I kind of got left behind when it came to quality of music but when it came to quantity man i got a crap ton of songs um i'd say i've done over 30 different shows in at least like five or six different states uh major capitals um i've made money from music uh whether that be just off uh hand-to-hand -hand sales uh, a little bit online, but like I always tell people, man, I'll make most of my money offline. So another big reason is because I see a lot of the same people making music and like this ain't a, this ain't a diss at all. But like I get more views now than I did when I was making music. And also, like I said, this ain't a diss, but like I make I get more views than they do like my social media platforms. Now that I make jokes or draw and just basically just do some of the goofiest things. Like I can literally draw a Pokemon and get more views than some of these underground rappers. And that's not a joke. Like that's, that's a literal statement. Like say I make a short, right? I can draw, I don't know, Pikachu or somebody. Right. And if I post it on YouTube, it's going to do like 10,000 views. If you don't believe me, go back and look at my picture that I drew of Pikachu cuz this is an actual this is an actual statistic. So, what I'm saying is I changed with the times. Like, I don't do things in 2021 that I used to do in 2011 or 2015 or even in 2020. Like, I have always constantly kept doing more and more and more and more and more. And I ended up getting banned from TikTok when I hit like 31 point something K, right? Well, when I hit 40, well, when I was going to hit 40 K, I was going to start dropping some more music, which that's my goal again. Whenever I hit 10,000 on TikTok, I'm going to drop another song because I didn't want to just drop a song and then it get 23 views, two likes, and then like nobody hears it. Or if anybody does hear it, they only hear it back in my hometown or something like that. Like, no. I know how to make a video go viral now, whether it be music, I can literally, I know how you could count cotton balls or something like that, or count beans in a cup and make that go viral. Like I, okay, sure. I only have a thousand subscribers on YouTube, but when it comes to TikTok and things like that, bro, I can tell you how to go viral, period. So why did I quit rapping? Because it ain't doing nothing for me anymore. Like if anything, like I said in the last one about like if you have a manager, or if you have a team, like do it for you. I'm going to say it right now, man. Do it for you. Don't even do it for your family. Yeah, do it for your family because you want to like support them. If you're not like, you know, your wife or your husband or you your kids that like that but i'm not talking about like your cousins your uncles not even your parents like do it for you but that's about it might do a part three i don't know because i got some other things i want to talk about especially when it comes to like um getting venues and stuff like that because literally if you pay for a venue right and you don't make the money back that you were supposed to make for the show. Like you got to pay all that up front. Anyway, I'm going to get into it in another video. I'm not even going to start on that. I'm going to get off into a tangent. But yeah, like, subscribe, all that good stuff.